I went down to the Sub-Zero pop-up at Abacus Coffee in Paran this morning, run by Kirk Pearson, and I loved it. I had some delicious coffees, read through an enormous menu of coffees, maybe the biggest menu I've ever seen, and also showed off this little Tampa pro prototype to a few people uh, who were standing around or sitting drinking some coffee, getting their reactions. So you'll get to see those coffees, the menu, and also a couple of people with shocked faces holding a 75 gram tamper. What on earth are you doing here? Just checking out your dope shirts. Hustle, hustle gram. Woo! Getting, getting my pecs in shot. <laughs> Do you like the freezer? The ice cream freezer is exceptional. What am I going to drink today, Kirk? Well, it's a, it's a very tough question, very open-ended question, because you've got 53 different choices. I know you don't like naturals, yep. but the 1211 from Owner Coffee yep. Roaster for Milk is just ballsy. It tastes so, so good. So, yep. if I'm to suggest to you a wash coffee, I might go the way of the Calibus La Sierra from Momo's Coffee. So, that's a wash coffee. <laughs> <laughs> That's a washed, uh, washed geisha. Um, white, came second in the cup of excellence. Hit me up, Guatemala. hit me up, boy. Right, so Look at that. Wow. Dialed in. Very cool. Dialed in on the Hot Wheels Slayer machine. That's cool. Oh, it's all about that impact on, like it cushions a little bit. Yeah. That's it. I need one of those printers. <laughs> yeah. Well, they're only a quarter of a million dollars. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> that's ergonomic. Ooh! Wow. That's funny. Todd, have you seen this? Whoa! Wow. It's like a spider web. Sick! Wow. Woo! Spider tent. Spider tent. Feel the press. Oh, what? <laughs> Is this the person made? Give it a... Sick, man. That's sick. Certified sick by Jessica Lambie. Hell yeah, Batman. It was delicious. I, I really like Kirk. I think he's doing a really great thing with Sub-Zero. He isn't bringing any hubris into it. He's just trying to find outrageous, delicious, uh, unique or weird coffees, sticking them in a freezer, vacuum sealing them, sticking them in a freezer, and serving them up uh, and look I love it I think more people will start to enjoy coffee and find out how varied and interesting it can be when there is a menu like that with such depth and breadth um, it's like it's starting to become like a wine menu which is exciting and they can know that when they're serving it to you that it's going to be like it was when they dialed it in maybe a week ago maybe a day ago maybe six months ago i love it i want to see more of it if anyone's doing it please let me know i, I want to see more of it and i want to promote more of it because it, it can only be good for specialty coffee if more people get to taste a wide range of interesting delicious coffees that's it from me